So unfolding new opportunities in the vast uh, field of information and technology, this BECAC graduate from Chandigarh University has got placed at Google with an impressive salary package of 28 lakhs per annum, undertaking his new responsibilities as corporate operations engineer with Google. CULMS Piyush Rathi will now talk to us live and sharing his experience about his transformation from academics to his professional journey and his overall journey at CU. So first of all, congratulations Piyush on securing placement in Google, which is one of the largest organizations in the world. Thank you so much. Thank you. So how are you feeling like you got placed in Google? Kaisa lag hai? Uh, to be honest, I'm a bit overwhelmed. Like uh, everyone, everywhere I go, like I'm seeing uh, crazy reactions from people, my friends, my family. A uh, lot of uh, people who were with me in college time, they reached out to me, like uh, congratulating me and everyone is happy around me. So okay. it's, I am a bit overjoyed, bit excited, bit curious about the journey where it will take me. <laughs> yeah, mixed emotions. Okay, okay, great, great. So I just wanted to know, like when you joined CU first, like what were your career aspirations back then? Because people kind of changed their mindset along the way. So aapka hamesha se ek hi goal tha or you changed it along the way, like... Uh, to be very honest, I was pretty clueless. <laughs> so when I joined college back in 2016, so uh, I like I didn't know much about computer science background, to be honest, and I didn't know much on the corporate sector and nothing like that. So first year I started uh, like in the end of first year, I seriously considered to join aeronautics and, <laughs> uh, and leave computer science behind because uh, I didn't like, you know, I didn't connect uh, too much with the subject at that point. So dhere dhere, uh, by third semester, uh, at that point, uh, we had a subject operating system and uh, after that uh, networking and all. So at that point, uh, my interest grew into computer science and uh, how all the technologies work because uh, jada fir core start hota na, jase jase third semester, fourth semester. So at that point, uh, things start clicking to me and at that point, you know, I knew that at least uh, no matter where the career takes me, at least I have to learn what the basics and whatnot is there. Yeah. Okay. okay. So what was, what was your mindset uh, when you first sat in the placement drive? Yeah, so uh, to be honest, didn't expect uh, like uh, much out of me because I knew that uh, our college, like, you know, there are a lot of companies coming because... Uh, like we uh, had seen that our seniors, which were who were there uh, previously in the last placement rounds, they were placed with really good packages as well. And uh, so, but uh, I uh, like I was not very good in communication side. So when I sat for the placement, I didn't expect much from my side. Like I thought, like uh, I'll get an average placement, and then maybe from there I'll take off my career somewhere. But uh, like I sat for my second placement and I got placed into Nutanix and which is also a really good company. So very thankful for, to, to Chandigarh University for that and uh, for shaping my career in, in all the ways. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So what were your takeaways from your placement drive? Uh, your first so placement drive. My first, uh, to be, so my first placement drive uh, I started out uh, for to I applied first of all uh, for some development roles, core development, but uh, like I could not clear the interview round. So at that point, I was bit, a bit uh, you know uh, nervous and like I thought maybe I will not be able to you know uh, make it uh, at a good placement and all. But after that, I sat for Microsoft company. Uh, there also I did not get selected. I went to the interview round there. I got rejected. And uh, so the key takeaway and uh, the third was Nutanix after that and where I got selected. So for me, the key takeaway was, you know, uh, keep learning uh, from your experiences. Never take them in a bad way. Like uh, if you sat for an interview and you did not get selected, that is also a good thing because you learned a lot at that point which you don't even realize at that time. Like uh, you learned what not to do, 
what was your mistakes how else you would have driven that so that you can uh, you know uh, make it in a better way so and uh, most uh, like and after that uh, learning always you know uh, comes in hand like always uh, you keep up with the whatever is there you learn a lot like you learn whatever is given to you and that you know helps you a lot uh, uh, when uh, when you have to actually do set something or when you actually have to you know sit for some placements and all yeah, yeah. okay so from your first year at cu to your first day at google like how has the journey been like Uh, it's been a joy ride so like it's been like a roller coaster coaster so like there are ups there are downs but uh, uh, being at uh, chandigarh university like uh, the fun uh, factor was always there like i enjoyed my four years of college that uh, that is for sure like uh, as chandigarh is uh, as, as the location himachal is near to you so you get to go on a lot of trips whenever you can plan them and uh, post that so uh, in like uh, when we started in our college from second year uh, there are some placement trainings as well so uh, for uh, like uh, i re- remember it's dcpd i am not sure uh, right now so there was some placement training as well and to be very honest those helped me really well uh, to uh, you know uh, accomplish my soft skills accomplish my aptitude make them better every day so uh, uh, i did the college i went to nutanix uh, three months into nutanix i was in an internship there so it was really cool i got to learn a lot of things there uh, in january it started in january 2020 so three months later pandemic started and we all had to you know uh, start working from home it was also good but it was a different experience uh, like till now i have been working from home only and it's like uh, not able to go to office so that's one thing but yeah other than that the journey it's been awesome like got to meet a lot of people who are very curious and very uh, like they have uh, really good aspirations and so interacting with them makes me also you know each every day makes me a better a person and better in my professional skills as well whatever i'm doing so yeah but so like i started in nitanix uh, intern uh, my internship started from january to june there i got selected like there was also some interviews and all i got selected for full time i start i worked uh, uh, in from august uh, 2020 uh, till uh, january 2022 i was there in nitanix as an sre uh, uh, full time and uh, so along the way the opportunity for google came in i applied uh, gave a lot of interviews and finally here i am so yeah well congratulations for that yeah so along the way you must have encountered a number of struggles and downfalls also so what motivated you to keep going like what motivates you in general so yeah yeah so i as i already told you like a uh, couple of places i failed i failed miserably like at some point i also thought that like this is not for me as well so yeah the those things come along but uh, in the end you have to see uh, what like you have to bit uh, be a bit focused on the end result like what you have to you know achieve in the end so like uh, so uh, our parents they had sent us like uh, for 15 hours 16 hours uh, journey from the hometown and we can't just you know go four years later and tell them that like now we are not doing anything with our life so that was one thing and the second thing was like uh, my friends for sure like i had really good friends so whenever i felt low i just you know had uh, some rants about with them like i ranted about things i ranted about life and in those talks you find some things which motivates you to you know do the next thing so that was there and uh, after that like there is was a lot of competition mm-hmm. like a uh, lot of uh, my peers who were really really good in what they do so a lot of competition and which you know competition i believe is the best motivator that is there so you compete with your friends and your peers so you see where you stand and it you strive to do better at that point so that was also a thing for me 
Okay, okay. Yes. So what are your future plans and your responsibilities, professional responsibilities in Google? Can you share something about that? Uh, as per my future plans, uh, right now I just you know want to accommodate myself here. Like it's a uh, it's a, like a completely different thing altogether. So I am just uh, understanding what uh, where I have landed, uh, what sort of people are there, what will be my responsibilities, and uh, uh, what uh, so and also every day is a new learning. So with the new roles, there will be new responsibilities which I have never done. And there will be new learnings for sure, like which I have never uh, like work. But there will be products on which I have never worked before, so those will be there. So yeah, right now I'm just uh, crossing my fingers that I can learn things as uh, like as much as I'm curious, but uh, I can learn things as well uh, with uh, the fast pace, uh, the pace that the organization is growing, and. Uh, Regarding my role, uh, so I am part of tech stop team in Google. So it's uh, internal IT support. So mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so my day-to-day -day responsibilities would be uh, so helping the process, helping the internal organization process, like uh, for all the employees who are working at Google, uh, the devices they use, uh, the internal tools they use, so help them make better and uh, help them uh, not face any issues uh, or if they face any issues help them you know resolve the issues fast and uh, with a very good experience as such so yeah okay so in the end like do you want to give any advice to the fellow students or students of chandigarh university who are, who are going to sit in the placement right this year like they are working yeah. So I, you know, I get a lot of LinkedIn messages and requests, like people ask me like every uh, week or so I get a message like, what should I do? How should I prepare and all that? So a couple of key points from my side is, so first is uh, always make sure you have, okay, CGP. Like I'm not saying like you have to be on the best uh, or you have to be on the top, but whatever you can manage, like be sure to get good grades because they will matter. You don't know that right now, you may be on the second semester, third semester, you think that it's okay, but they matter like, uh, or because as we know, there are a lot of students and a lot of, uh, but there are only limited positions. So whether you are good at something or not, you have to be go, go on through the short listing rounds and all for many organization. And it's not just one college, everywhere it's the same. So uh, you have to, you know, maintain good grades so that uh, in the end, you don't feel like you would have done something, but you know, something stopped you. So that's a very bad feeling. Uh, sure. So, because you know that you are good at something, but you are not able to do because of some other thing. So that's one thing also, you know, getting good grades will also help you <laughs> making the subject stronger. So uh, it's in turn uh, altogether a good thing. Like you help one thing and it will help you uh, uh, side by side. So that's one thing. And second thing is also uh, try to uh, understand the companies that come, like what all the try to understand the roles they are bringing to the uh, college. So uh, prepare accordingly. So me, I have been not been a on the development side, so I can't comment much like what to do on that, but belong to a profile which requires strong networking, strong operating system uh, skills, and then communication. So for me, the thing that helped me most was, even though I didn't know a lot of topics or a lot of subjects, but my concepts was always clear, like basic concepts, they were clear. So that's what I was, you know, I would, uh, you know, advise my uh, like juniors and all as well, that uh, whatever you read, whatever you, uh, whatever you are uh, taught in class and all, make sure that your basics are clear. Like, you know, uh, how to put two and two together before you solve an entire, uh, integration or differential equation as such. So that's the, like, you know, that's, uh, these are the two major things that I would like to say. And third is uh, like on the minimal side, try to have fun. Like it's not this journey, you will, you know, you will miss a lot, a lot, like the college time and it will never, uh, never be there again until and unless you pursue masters and all that's a different thing, but yeah. So try to enjoy the time 
try to interact with uh, as much people as you can and uh, uh, and learn from your failures like even if you get rejected in something or uh, like even if you are not able to make in something try to strive more and in the end for sure you are definitely going to get something good in your life because hard work always pays off so yeah yeah okay so thank you so much piyush for your time and sharing your experiences congratulations for your placement so thank you so much and stay tuned for more sessions with chandigarh university thank you